Okay, so... Uh, da -da -da -da. Basically, I pulled over and I just checked to see if it was recording, and it should be recording. Uh, basically, I've got an old... I had an old set of headphones, and the earbuds were no good, but the microphone still works. So... What I'm going to try to do is, I want to try and use the microphone on the camera if I can, on my iPhone camera um, to, uh, hold on, I just got to check behind me and pull up to this driveway here um, I'm going to try to use it, maybe I could do like, try and do vlogs I think it's quite hard for a cyclist to do vlogging um, I think it's easier for a motorbike. Um, please tell me if you are a motorbiker, if it's not. Um, and this is quite thin. Oh dear. And bumpy. I think it, look, it would look quite odd if I was to talk in front of people because it's like... I think, I don't really have headphones, I got, I got the microphone, but you can't really see it. But yeah, basically I cut off the headphones, because the thing is, I really don't want to use headphones while cycling. I hate using headphones, I used to wear headphones, and, and as much as I enjoy the music, um, it was, this was back in the heyday, back when I was like 14, 15, doing paper routes. Um, yeah, I used to have headphones, but I also didn't have a mirror either, so I could never tell what was behind me, and I couldn't hear anything. So I don't, and that was in Leicestershire as well. Um, I don't mind, I think Leicestershire is a lot safer for cycling. Um, I only say that because, so basically cy t cycling in Leicester. You've got you've got the infrastructure, and they the and recently even st from the year of two thousand nine something like that, they've been adding infrastructure to the cycling in Leicestershire. So you feel safer cycling in Leicestershire, and it's a lot smaller city, I think. I mean, there are some daft drivers once in a while, but I would say a majority of Leicester is quite safe for cycling. Um, I don't I hardly, sometimes I don't even use my camera. I trust Leicestershire that much. So, yeah, I mean, Leicestershire is a bit safer, but being in Birmingham with headphones on, I do have my mirror. I do have a mirror from the USA. It's a pretty good mirror. It's really good. Like it's it's got like a wide view. It look, it's like a mini car mirror, pretty much. And they just they've pretty much put an attachment on it for bikes. Um, part of it is broken, so I've had to duct tape the rest of it on. But it still works, and I still get a nice crisp view all around from behind me. I can, uh, I can even use it sometimes to see what's on my left behind me. Um, but yeah, I mean, cycling in Birmingham with headphones on, I would, I would not want to do that at all. It's just, it's too dangerous. I mean, you got, you have this nice cycling here, but. I don't always cycle this way, a lot of times I'll cycle into the city and there's hardly any infrastructure whatsoever. Alright, I'm going to stop the recording now and see what we got in, just to make sure that everything I've been saying is actually going to the microphone. Uh, that would be a bit, a bit of a waste of time if it didn't. are quite wide. I, don't, I can't remember the size, but they are quite wide. And then I also got like a, a four inch mirror sticking out on the right hand side. It doesn't help when you try to filter, that's for sure. <laughs> However, I do like having the mirror because it's a pretty, it's a, it's a darn good one, it really is. I got it from Walmart. 
It's funny, back there I was talking and I forgot to put the microphone in. Anyway, I was saying, I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing vlogging all the time. I would, I'd I would like to try as much as I can. Nice little bridge there uh, behind me. Um, simply because it's it's quite um, it's, it, at the moment until I figure out another way to attach it or close to my mouth or something. I was thinking about getting one of those. There's like little clips you can get for headphones where you can clip it to your shoulder or something. I think about trying to find out if I can get one of those. Is at the moment I have to plug it in to my phone. That's what I'm doing now. But the hassle is, is that I have to loop it through my zips. So in the summer, I won't be wearing zips. I'll be wearing short sleeves. I don't know where I'm going now. I'm just going to follow this route. I'm pretty sure I follow this one. This one looks like the longest. I hate when you get lost. Ooh, pretty bump there. But I would like to try and use it while cycling. I think that'd be quite cool, do my own cycling vlogs. But it's nice because I don't have to wear the headphones because I chopped them off. <laughs> Chopping the headphones off. They were quite an old pair anyway. But yeah, I mean, it's easier to do vlogs as a motorbike. You're like, can yeah, you get the equipment? Um, you can just like buy it and then they with the microphone already built in. Is what I'd like to know. I bet you everybody's like looking at me like, oh, who the heck is this guy talking to? He's talking to himself, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking to my viewers on YouTube. If you are watching this, if you are, can you like for me and comment for me if you are? I want to know if you're watching me. Well, you're not watching me, but you're watching me cycle. Well, look at this little bridge up here. This looks quite nice. I think I could have made it over that, but I slowed down for the little boy. Whenever I see kids, I prefer slowing down for them because you don't know what, where they're going to run run next. It's always safe to, always better to play it safe around little kids. Plus a lot of the parents respect that as well. And it's likely that they might be drivers. And if they are drivers, they might be considerate to more cyclists. <laughs> So, you know, it plays in both ways, really. At the moment, I'm not really using the rear camera. I don't think there's much of a need for the rear camera through here. I see magpies. Oh, I'll tell you what, it's a bit of an incline, if I'm honest. Technically, I am going into higher ground. However, this path ain't very wide either. Um, I might stop the camera again because I don't know where I'm going after this. It looks like there's a road coming up. This is a nice pathway. I love to do my studying down here. Oh no, there's one of these stupid gates. Oh, there's two of them. There's one to my right and there's one right here. Oh, I hate these things. Yeah, I'll see why. Well, you can't really see why, but I'm too wide. <sighs> oh, jeeky. Can't even get through it. Yeah, I don't like getting muddy once in a while. Once in a blue moon is all right, but in the winter you just clean your you, you clean your bike so many times, and I only use it an average of maybe three or four times a week into the city and out. I don't know what's going on there. Like a group of three people or something there. I do kind of hope. I want to get some pictures actually. I might stop the camera real quick. Right, that's five miles an hour. 
too fast for a tent. It looks as if they're doing work. Oh, there's a bench there. I see a bench. Get on camera before I forget. Hey, thumbs up and everything. No, 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 there's two people waving at you and everything. There's two people waving at you. <laughs> Hi! <laughs> 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 <laughs>